So check out this five iron face on down the line. Face on, kind of smacking a couple here. And let me kind of explain what we're doing. You see that uh, new game changing training product on the ground. And what's it doing for me there? Well, let me explain. So I'm going to, on the right screen, I'm going to put this up here. And you'll see pretty clearly that there is an arm that will project a golf ball to me at a prescribed pace that will arrive right where I'm set up. Now, working a little bit with the app, I can put in the speed I want to athletically charge my backswing to arrive at impact pretty mindlessly really, just reflex, just subconscious to kind of flush a golf ball while it's moving at me. So I'm not really thinking, I'm reacting. Now that same, it's got a practice mode where the next ball, once you hit it, the ball gets pushed out at you and then you can just kind of leave the the gate open and it's going to leave a ball there for you and then you can go ahead and hit it immediately thereafter. Now I did it with a series of shots. Um, my f good friend George Goebel called me over 10 years ago now and with this idea and I've heard other teaching pros rolling golf balls at students to get them more responsive and athletic. So here's that same timing with a three wood. Again I probably hit three wood 240 in the air, 245 in the air. I swing at about 102 miles an hour. So this is a ball that's absolutely flushed. And everybody wants consistency. Everybody wants that. You know, they don't want to be thinking over the golf ball. Well, when you get this organized for your athleticism and rhythm, which is probably faster than you think, it's you're way more capable of an athlete than you give yourself credit for. Okay, you're going to start to really be the unconscious ball striker that you want to be. You know, so I went through the bag with an eight iron, a five iron, here's the eight iron, or there's the five iron. Let's come back to, uh, we'll just play this one out. Here's the five iron, arm goes away, and you know what, I'll sync these up here. Let's come back and take this one right from my first little touch on the pad there. Well, that one's on the and then on the left screen, right there, kind of sync these up so you can kind of take a look. They may not be perfectly synced, but pretty close. And then in my real swing to my reflex arc swing, you know, it's just such a more athletic event. It's so less thought involved in, you know, really melting a golf ball out there. I'm not going to lie, I missed a bunch of shots kind of figuring out what my rhythm is, but once I got it dialed in, surprisingly, you know, amazingly how, you know, shot after shot just kind of came out the middle of the face. And, you know, am I really trying to hit it? I'm, I'm conscious of, sure, conscious of where the ball, and there's the eight iron, conscious of where the ball is going to roll by. And you can see that little, there's a little mark on the mat that you put a template down and the template, you put a little dot of powder there so you kind of know where the ball is going to be presented. And then you just start moving your body athletically. And it's amazing how quite often you're going to flush golf shots. I mean, it's a fascinating learning tool. I've had the good fortune of kind of using different iterations of this over the years. And when I put a golfer in this, it really doesn't have a sense of rhythm and timing, which is a lot of you out there, you know, this is what really makes people be an athlete hitting a golf shot. So I can't wait for the coaches out there to get a hold of this and start training their athletes on how to really strike it with a reflex arc.